Hey, what's going on everyone? This is Ari Views back with another video and today we're talking about the new iOS 18 home screen. As you probably know with iOS 18, it's now easier than ever to customize your device and get some custom setups on the home screen of your device, customize your iPhone, make it look totally different than it used to be before. And in this video, I will show you guys the top five setups that you can easily create on the home screen of your iOS 18 device today. And we're starting with this one right here, a very simple minimal setup for your device. Now, what I'm doing here, it's very simple. Just simply go ahead and add a totally black wallpaper to your iPhone. Now, once you have done that, of course, you will have the normal icons of your device, so you will have this layout right here. Now, it doesn't look that good, does it? But what you can do is switch to large right here, that way you will remove the labels from the icons, make the icons and the home screen look much, much cleaner, and then you want to add the tint to your icons. Now, by just tapping the tint right there, it will add a, that tint, that gray tint, of course, it looks really, really awesome. Now, if you don't want to go with that gray tint, you can also make it a bit lighter. So you go back to customize and you will have the second slider right here. You can go ahead and make them a bit lighter if you want to. And voila, you get that awesome setup on your iPhone. It actually looks amazing. It looks very simple, black and white, absolutely beautiful. The next one will be this two-tone setup. Now, this is actually pretty awesome. Probably the best setups you can get on your iOS 18 device are the two-tone ones where you get a wallpaper. It has only two colors. Now, the wallpaper must have only two colors. Now, I prefer that you have a black part of the wallpaper and then another color like this one right here. Now, to get this setup, it's fairly simple. You, once you add the wallpaper, you find the wallpaper that you use, you can just go ahead and tap on the edit button, tap on customize, and just choose tint right there. And of course, choose large so that you actually remove the icon labels and they look much, much cleaner. So you can see how good of a setup this is. And of course, if you have like an object or anything on that wallpaper, you can just move the icons around it. As of course, with iOS 18, now you can just place the icons anywhere you want. And you can see this amazing setup that you can easily get on your iOS 18 device. Now, let me show you guys another example here of the two-tone setup. Now, here we have the second example. Now, in this case, we have a wallpaper that's mostly black, but it has like this orange and red color that actually stands out. It's pretty awesome. And this way you can also get an amazing setup. Simply go ahead and go to the customize mode right here and make sure you tap on this button to pick a color. So it allows to pick any color on the wallpaper. So you go ahead and pick the color there that you want. And there you have it. You will have now the icons tinted with this color while the other part is black and it actually looks pretty clean. Now, this is also another setup that you can create where you have an object on a photo and then you just work around that object. Like you can see, we have the same wallpaper here as before, but the difference here is that we're just placing the icons around the object. In this case, we have this rocket right here and we can just go ahead and pick these icons and just place them right there. So let's go ahead and place them right here where the blank spaces are. And then all we have here on the empty space is that subject of the wallpaper, which actually looks pretty stunning. So the subject there will stand out, whether you have maybe a picture of any of your pets or a picture of a person or whatever that is, you can just move the icons out of the way of the subject and you get this really awesome setup. Now, here is another one that you can easily create. It's actually pretty simple, but in my opinion, it looks great. You just place the icons in the middle two rows. So you have four rows of icons on your iOS device. You remove this one on the left, this one on the right, and just place the icons there in the middle. It actually looks pretty awesome. Now you can go with a split wallpaper like this. Just go ahead and Google split wallpapers for iPhone, and you can get like wallpapers like this one, or you can just do it 
with the normal wallpaper. But again, in this case, if we have a bunch of colors on the wallpaper, we're going on with the dark mode icon. So all you have to do here is go to the edit mode. Now, if you just want to use the dark mode icons, you select them right here and you don't select the automatic mode. Of course, go with large to remove the labels, make the icons look much, much cleaner. And you will get this easy to create and very simple, but really clean looking setup. And we're saving the best for last right here. Probably the cleanest setup that you can get on your iOS 18 device where you use just a widget on the home screen. Now, in this case, we're using this one from Widget. You can download Widget for free from the App Store. I will leave it linked right down below in the description of the video. Now, what's really cool is that with Widget, you can have transparent widgets on your home screen. Like you can see right here, the background there is just the wallpaper that we have. It doesn't have a background for the widget itself. Now, what I've did done here, I, I just went ahead and removed all the icons. So we have just this one page with this widget. Of course, you can select another widget that you want to, and then just go ahead and tint the icons for the dock so it looks much, much cleaner. And of course, it matches the wallpaper. Now you can see we have here pretty cool like widget from widget. And if we just tap on it like this, it will show us the weather forecast for the next day. So it's actually interactive. It's pretty awesome. Again, tap right there, it goes back to the simple view. Not to add this, all you have to do is again, install Widget on your device. And once you have Widget, first of all, the first thing you want to do is set up your transparent background to do that on your home screen. You just tap and hold to go to the edit mode. Once you're on the edit mode, you swipe here to the page where you see nothing but the wallpaper and the dock and you take a screenshot right here. Now go ahead and open the widget app and all you have to do here under widget. Now once you open widget, all you have to do here is go to the manage section, tap on setup transparency and right here, go ahead and tap on both of these and just load the screenshot you just took and you're good to go. Now you have it set it up for your device and whenever you set the home screen widget right here. All you have to do is just choose the place where you want to place it. So you get that transparent look in the background of your widget and make it look really nice and clean. So this is how easy it is to create these amazing five setups on your iPhone or running the new iOS 18. And of course, it has been made very, very easy by Apple adding these additional customization features to the home screen of your iOS 18 device. Now, anything that you need for these setups, I don't think you need anything besides the link to the widget app, you will be able to find it under the description of this video. So you can go ahead and download it for free from the app store. And that's basically it. So I hope you guys enjoyed the video. Hopefully you enjoyed these setups and you will create any of them on your device. That is it for this video. Thank you guys again for watching it. If you enjoyed it, smash that like button. If you want to see more iOS 18 videos, make sure you subscribe to the channel and I will see you on the next one.